All right, guys, so we were at the Bellagio checking out the botanical gardens. We're like, okay, so uh, you want to walk over to the Park Street MGM and check out the Christmas stuff out there? And Steve-O back there is like, I'm too cold. And Chrissy is like, yeah, I'm gay with whatever. And I'm like, I just want a beer. No, I'm just kidding. Actually, I want a glass of wine. And uh, either way, I'm like, either we can go check out the Park Street MGM or we'll just check out the Bellagio wine. So here we are at a poker bar. Chrissy's playing some buffalo. Steve-O's playing some video poker. Yeah, I know this whole, whoop, you can't even, okay, so here, let me show you what's going on here. All right, so we are separated by these glass, like we are in a contained little room. Yeah, hi. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers to you, buddy. <laughs> She's playing the buffalo. She does pretty well on that. I don't. Steve-O's doing his thing. I'm doing a little buffalo key now. I was playing a little buffalo slots. I, I, you know, slots just take my money so quick, and I just want to play 20 bucks. And uh, our bartender has disappeared on us, by the way. But uh, yeah, so I just wanted to show you. Let's see. Let's see if we even win. See. And um, uh, no, but at least I'm only playing five cents. So I actually won something on slots. Holy cow! Three dollars and twenty cents. <laughs> All right, I'm playing a little Captain's Key now. I mean, I've been switching it up every five minutes, so I hey, got three. So that's cool. And Christy over there is playing Key now. Keep changing it up too. She was playing Captain's Key now, now she's playing Buffalo Key now. Steve O's still playing his video poker. <laughs> of course, I'm only playing my 20 bucks as usual. Once I get down to my five, I guess I'll just lay it all back on the slots again and see what it brings me. Probably nothing but a free glass of wine. Well, I got some free 12 games because I got some kind of bird in one of my kinos. So, that's cool. I'm down with some free games. Yeah. Even if I'm not winning any of them. All right, so steve was cashing out. And me and Chris are like, what the hell? We're having fun. We're just playing our last 10 bucks. I'm like, what happened, Steve? Like, you want to cash out? You want to leave? You must have lost your money real quick. This is what he does to me all the time. He always does this. He won. He won. $220.70. What'd you win this on, dude? I hit all four numbers. Hmm. Did you play four card Kino? I, no, I just played four. I just played red Kino. And, oh, you maxed and I, it? And I played four numbers and I hit all four numbers. How many uh, things did you play? Like, how many? I was a max there. Yeah. Max, wow. Good job, Steve-O. <laughs> max that. Good job, Steve-O. He did it again. He did it again. Well, since Mr. Moneybags won us enough money, I might as well just play the last ten dollars sixty-five cents <laughs> on buffalo. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> you damn straight. I'm gonna. Well, how do you know I'm gonna lose it? Look how look how Diamond Jim Brady she's over here. Let's just throw this money away. <laughs> okay, but I'm just saying it's kind of a nice feeling Sweet just being like, you know what? I'm just gonna. Again. How do you know I'm gonna lose? How do you know I'm gonna lose? I don't. Right, so we're going to be playing some Buffalo, because some people play really well on Buffalo. I guess I can, uh... We're going to do this. Put, sit down again, I guess. So you just sit behind me and just wish for the best. Hope for the best. Let's do this. All right, Chrissy's laughing at me. Oh, yeah, you like Steve-O's winnings better? Yeah, whatever. So, um, I was telling Steve-O, like, okay, he's like, stop not max betting, just play it out. We all got to go home. I'm like, I'm going to Buffalo this thing out. And then I'm winning, so I'm like, why don't I just cash out? It's kind of stupid. Four bucks. <laughs> don't be jealous, people. He's not laughing over there. <laughs> all right, guys. All right, guys, we are ending our night here. That was a good night. I didn't really actually think we'd win here at the Bellagio. You know, we're on the strip. I wasn't sure about that. Yeah, look at the piano ball. All right, guys. I don't think anyone can hear a thing you said right now. <laughs> I, I couldn't hear you. I doubt they could, but maybe. Oh, they probably could. I'm sure. I'm pretty close. My phone has pretty good uh, mic on it. All right. All right, guys. Well, we all had a good time. Yeah. <laughs> all right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it as well as we enjoyed doing this. So uh, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye, everybody. Bye. Hey, guys. I'm back. I have a quick question.
You need to focus on the road, buddy. I'm focused. Okay, so me and Christy were like, hey, there's tickets in the glass. You have to pay for it. How would you know not to? She was looking at it going, oh, and Steve-O goes, no, it's comped. I'm like, well, how would you know that? You just know that. It's like a hidden menu like it is now. <laughs> but how would you know that? How would you know there's tickets in the glass? That means the drinks are comped. You just pay for the tip while you're... You know, like, I mean, we've been doing that the wildfire, and we've just been walking away, just giving them our little tip, and we're still welcome there, so I'm assuming we're doing the right thing, or they would be like, oh, those yes, people don't pay right for their thing. drinks. But how is that a known thing? Do you just ask, or how do you know? You, I, you know, the ins and outs, like I said, the ins and outs of Vegas, you just gotta, you just gotta... You just gotta know. You just it's gotta, like the you mom, know you just gotta know. Ask, you gotta you know? know, you gotta know. Uh, you know, people, somebody told me that, you, that they comp drinks, at the bar, and then so I went up and and I expected a comp drink, you know. And the guy says, "Hey, no, you can't just play a dollar. You gotta you gotta put in a 20 I'm like, "Oh, oh all right." So you learn. You, you sometimes you embarrass yourself, but you learn. But now this guy didn't say anything, so I guess that was a uh, comped drinks while we played, and then we just well, he watched us put money in. Yeah, that's true. But those other places we put twenty bucks in, and we still had to pay for a drink. What was up with that? Oh, uh, well, they've got that system where they know how much you're gambling. Right, and Bellagio so didn't Bellagio, do that. Well, Bellagio, and they, I think Bellagio that. can afford it. <laughs> I don't so, think they're being quite so picky. You're playing you. penny slots I mean, at 40 some of the, a piece. Not all local casinos so, do that, but some of them were like, yeah, if you don't play fast enough or enough, even though you're putting your 20 bucks in, you still have to pay for a drink, and I was kind of disappointed. So we haven't gone back to those said places. I'm not going to name them, but... I'm just saying. It was just kind of disappointing. So, apparently, if you put a glass... Or, or not a glass of a drink. Paper in a glass. It is comped. Whoa. Says the Stevo. <laughs> so, so Stevo says... <laughs> now, watch somebody does it not work for them for some reason. They're going to come back and... And they're like, well, <laughs> Stevo told me that. They're yeah. like, who the hell is that guy? <laughs> They're going to say, you know Steve-O? Yeah. <laughs> oh, right. well, then we'll comp it then. <laughs> <laughs> you never know, man. All right, guys. Thank you for watching our last-minute little snippet of our vlog. Oh, my uh, gosh. It's how we do. Bye.